Our hymn is number 214 in your Lumen Christi hymnals. Number 214. God, come to my assistance. Lord, make haste to help me. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, to God who is, who was, and who is to come, now and forever. Amen. Alleluia. O boundless wisdom, God most high, O maker of the earth and sky, who bids the guarded waters flow in heaven above, on earth below, the streams on earth, the clouds in heaven, by thee their ordered bounds were given, lest he the untempered fires of day the parched soil should waste away. Even so on us who seek thy face, pour forth the waters of thy grace, renew the fount of life within, and quench the wasting fires of sin. <clears throat> Let faith discern the eternal light, Beyond the darkness of the night, and through the mist of falsehood see the path of truth revealed by thee. O Father, that we ask be done through Jesus Christ, thine only Son, who with the Holy Ghost and thee do live and reign eternally. Amen. <clears throat> my flesh is food indeed, and my blood is drink indeed. Alleluia. I will thank the Lord with all my heart in the meeting of the just in their assembly. Great are the works of the Lord to be pondered by all who love them. Majestic and glorious His work, His justice stands firm forever. He makes us remember His wonders, the Lord is compassion and love. He gives food to those who hear, keeps his covenant ever in mind. He has shown his might to his people by giving them the lands of the nations. His works are justice and truth. His precepts are all of them sure. Standing firm forever and ever, they are made in uprightness and truth. He has sent deliverance to his people and established his covenant forever. Holy his name to be feared. To fear the Lord is the first stage of wisdom. All who do so prove themselves wise. His praise shall last for Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, to God who is, who was, and who is to come, now and forever. Amen. My flesh is food indeed, and my blood is drink indeed. (laughs) 
Even who would I sing him who is invisible? Alleluia. Happy the man who fears the Lord, who takes delight in all his commands. His sons will be powerful on earth, the children of the upright are blessed. Riches and wealth are in his house, his justice stands firm forever. He is a light in the darkness for the upright. He is generous, merciful, and just. A good man takes pity and lands. He conducts his affairs with honor. The just, just man will never waver. He will be remembered forever. He has no fear of evil news. With a firm heart he trusts in the Lord. With a steadfast heart he will not fear. He will see the downfall of his foes. Open-handed he gives to the poor. His justice stands firm forever. His head will be raised in glory. The wicked man sees and is angry, grinds his teeth and fades away. The desire of the wicked needs to do. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, to God who is, who was, and who is to come, now and forever. Amen. Endured as seeing Him who is invisible. He humbled himself and became obedient unto death. Therefore God has highly exalted him. I will praise you, Lord, you have rescued me and have not let my enemies rejoice over me. O Lord, I cried to you for help. And you, my God, have healed me. O Lord, you have raised my soul from the dead, restored me to life from those who sink into the grave. Sing psalms to the Lord, you who love him. Give thanks to his holy name. His anger lasts a moment, his favor all through life. At night there are tears, but joy comes with dawn. I said to myself in my good fortune, nothing will ever disturb me. Your favor had set me on a mountain vastness. Then you hid your face, and I was put to confusion. To you, Lord, I cried. To my God, I made appeal. What profit would my death be, my going to the grave? Can thus give you praise or proclaim your truth? The Lord listened and had pity. The Lord came to my help. For me you have changed my mourning into dancing. You removed my sackcloth and girded me with joy. So my soul sings psalms to you unceasingly. O Lord my God, I will thank you forever. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, to God who is, who was, and who is to come, now and forever. Amen. He humbled himself and became obedient unto death. Therefore God has highly exalted him. Blessed be our Father, who has blessed us in Christ. 
Praised be the God and Father of our Lord Jesus Christ, who has bestowed on us in Christ every spiritual blessing in the heavens. God chose us in Him before the world began to be holy and blameless in His sight. He predestined us to be set up his sons through Jesus Christ. Such was his will and pleasure that all might praise the glorious favor he has bestowed on us in his beloved. In him and through his blood we have been redeemed and our sins forgiven. So immeasurably generous is God's favor to us. God has given us the wisdom to understand fully the mystery, the plan he was pleased to decree in Christ, a plan to be carried out in Christ in the fullness of time, to bring all things into one in him, in the heavens and on Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, to God who is, who was, and who is to come, now and forever. Amen. Blessed be our Father, who has blessed us in Christ. From the letter to the Colossians. May you attain full knowledge of God's will through perfect wisdom and spiritual insight. Then you will lead a life worthy of the Lord and pleasing to Him in every way. You will multiply good works of every sort and grow in the knowledge of God. By the might of His glory, you will be endowed with the strength needed to stand fast, even to endure joyfully whatever may come giving thanks to the Father for having made you worthy to share the lot of the saints in light. He rescued us from the power of darkness and brought us into the kingdom of his beloved Son. Mode 7. My soul proclaims the greatness of the Lord. My spirit rejoices in God my Savior. For he has looked with favor on his holy servant. From this day all generations will call me blessed. The Almighty has done great things for me, and holy is his name. 
He has mercy on those who fear him in every generation. He has shown the strength of his arm. He has scattered the proud in their conceit. He has cast down the mighty from their thrones and has lifted up the lowly. He has filled the hungry with good things and the rich he has sent away empty. He has come to the help of his servant Israel, for he has remembered his promise of mercy. The promise he made to our fathers, to Abraham and his children forever. Glory to the Father and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, to God who is, who was, and who is to come, now and forever. Amen. Precursor Johannes exulta cum Jordane, patizado domino, Faca esorbis terrarum exhortatio, Faca est pegatorum nostrorum remissio, Sanctificans aquas. Ipsi omnes clamemus miserere nobis. God has made an everlasting covenant with his people, and he never ceases to bless them. Grateful for these gifts, we confidently direct our prayer to him. Kyrie eleison. Kyrie eleison. Save your people, Lord, and bless your inheritance. Gather into one body all who bear the name of Christian, that the world may believe in Christ, whom you have sent. Give our friends and our loved ones a share in divine life. Let them be symbols of Christ before men. Show your love to those who are suffering. Open their eyes to the vision of your revelation. For the four students who are visiting, may God show them their pathway forward. <clears throat> For all of our benefactors, Be compassionate to those who have died. Welcome them into the company of the faithful departed. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Father, may this evening pledge of our service to you bring you glory and praise. For our salvation you looked with favor on the lowliness of the Virgin Mary. Lead us to the fullness of the salvation you have prepared for us. We ask this through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you and the Holy Spirit, one God forever and ever. Amen.
The Lord be with you. And And with with your spirit. spirit. May Almighty God bless you, the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Go in the peace of Christ. Thanks Thanks be to to God. God. May the divine assistance be always with us. And And also also with our our brothers brothers and sisters. sisters. Cardiology of January the 14th. In the 5th century before Christ, the prophet Malachi, he announced that the messianic era to be prepared by the sending of a precursor would reestablish the moral and cultural order. It would also culminate in a perfect sacrifice offered to God by every nation. Around 260, St. Felix, priest of Nola and <coughs> Campania, confessor of the faith whose fame extended from Gaul to Africa. The year of grace, 1237, Saint Sabas, son of the king of Serbia, he entered the monastery of Mount Athos at an early age. Later named Metropolitan of Serbia, he established there the Catholic hierarchy and encouraged the founding of schools. He is recognized by the Serbs as a great promoter of their culture. Elsewhere, the heavenly birth of numerous other saints whose names are inscribed in the Book of Life. 